Okay, I just wanted to show you guys a couple more examples of the silhouette sign. So the silhouette sign in, in basic terms means that the reason why we could see the contours of structures on radiographs is because those objects are next to an object of a different density. So the heart is of water density, the lungs are of air density. So in this case we can see the left heart border which is of water density because it's right next to the air density of the lung. Um, in this example, we lose the right heart border. So if we take what we know about the lobar anatomy, we can predict where this opacity is. We don't even need a lateral view. So the right heart border is um, immediately adjacent to the right middle lobe. So we can say with certainty that this opacity is in the right middle lobe. And we happen to have a CT here, and if we look at it, this is the right middle lobe, and there's a consolidation right here which touches the right heart border, it, which confirms our suspicion from the radiograph, and we can see that this is the right lower lobe, which is completely clear. Okay, so this is the example that I showed in class. What we have here is an opacity in the left lung, and we want to determine whether this opacity is in the left upper lobe or the left lower lobe. So just from knowing what we know about the silhouette sign, and the lobar anatomy of the lung, we can figure it out. So this opacity is superimposed over the heart, but it does not obscure the left heart border. So we know that the left heart border is immediately adjacent to the lingula, and because we can see that border very clearly here, this opacity must be in the left lower lobe and not in the lingula. If this were in the lingula, this left heart border would be completely obscured. And when we go to the CT, our suspicions are confirmed. So this is the left upper lobe. We scroll down. This is the left heart border here. This is the left ventricle. And we have this big area of consolidation here. So even though this is a very dense area of consolidation, because it is not immediately adjacent to the left heart border, we can still see those structures very clearly here on the radiograph. So if you're still confused about any of these concepts, I'll leave my email in the description section and you can send me an email.